all proffer the same defense. They say they were being controlled by a demon. Will you make some inquiries? One of our demon-possessed mobsmen is being held behind bars at this very moment. You may want to begin your search there. Okay. Yeah. Yep, I threw that knife because I just couldn't stand that singing. It was pissing me off. I was trying to concentrate to what Charles was saying. Like, seriously, God's sake. Time and place for everything. Making such a racket. Besides, I have no idea if YouTube's gonna have some questions about that Pacific song, so I'm not gonna risk it. I'm not gonna risk it at all. Just gonna shut them up. No, don't mind me. Jeez, not like you haven't seen that before. Done it several times in this police building. What's that man done? Rob the pawnbrokers down the road. A demon made me do it. I can't remember much. That's what's so queer. I've never stolen anything in my life before. Let's pretend that I believe you. Tell me who made you do it. All I can recall is a silver watch swinging in mid-air. It was held by someone or something. A dark presence whispering. Oh, I'd only see the its love eyes. Of God, a it was demon. hypnosis. I'll need to verify this with the shopkeeper. It was hypnosis. Some asshole hypnotized him. And that only works on the weak-minded. So get out of the way. That person is weak minded, got hypnotized, robbed the shop, and seriously was he robbing the shop to test out if he could rob something much more bigger. Oh, wait a minute, let me time this right. Okay, that worked. Give me this, I need it more than you. Easy, easy. I wonder. What if robbing that shop was just like a test run and then you'll use another victim to rob something bigger? Or maybe I'm just overthinking this. Because this is just a side quest. It's like I finished the main missions so long ago. I'm just trying to 100% this. Well, 100% it as best I can. Shopkeeper, you remember me? What can you tell me about the robbery? There's not much to say. Most of the items did come from the same seller, Enzio Capelli, Sorcerer Supreme, a famous showman from Italy. Several weeks ago, he was forced to pawn his family heirlooms, debts. I'll have the address of the last person who redeemed something of his, a lovely pearl necklace. That helpful? Not again! Stop her! Stop! Oh, Somebody seriously. Stop the Run, Evie! Seriously, I could have catched and tackled this person ages ago. And the game just allowed me to walk slowly in that direction. I couldn't just catch her right now. And what? Okay, this game is just allowing this chase to happen. Like, she is clearly faster. But look at that. She's even running more faster. How the. Come on, get her now. Yes. Where am I? What's happening? Seriously? Took something from a pawn shop. It's all very hazy, but I remember something silver flashing in front of my eyes. Then I heard a sort of bell. Next thing I know, I'm here with you. My only lead is this mysterious buyer. Right. 
Locate the last player. Punch his lights out. The end. Oh, seriously, this guy is an asshole. Probably not as a big of an asshole as Kilgrave, but um, but still, hip hypnotizing people and putting that kind of shit, I I don't like that. That type of stuff pisses me off. Okay. Like, right. This chap might lead me to the demon. Which chap? Where? All right. I did want to use Eagle Vision ages ago, but oh, oh, for God's sake! What? Climb on the same cart as the thief. Tell the thief without being spotted. Fuck off! These dumb optional mission bullshit. Yeah, take your time. Just jeez. It's not like I haven't got anything better to do. First he was just running and now he is really slowly walking. Oh no more rooftops or Anyone up on that roof? Probably not. Take my chances. Oh, there were people on this roof. Or... What is this? Buddy balcony or... Oh, rooftop. Where are you going? Okay. He's really taking his sweet time. Oh, seriously. Fuck me. Bloody zip line down. Keep going down. Risk it, risk it. I can't even jump in this bush. Can I make it? Can I make it? <laughs> Whoa, dude, seriously. This is the most craziest thing ever. Best stay invisible as well. Last thing I need are blighters spotting me doing this bullshit. You shouldn't be able to spot me. I'm. Oh, fuck you! I'm invisible. How could he? You know. Off. Honestly, fuck off with that shit. I don't even care if I failed the optional mis mission. Like the the main things that count is that I passed the main optional missions, and that's what I did. Stop this music! Fuck's sake! Can I kill this thief? I want to give you the necklace now. Really to have to speak to So that person was hypnotized, I bet. Hello. Mr. Enzio Capelli, I presume. Don't you dare so get hypnotized. Stab him. Jewels. 
You are very much mistaken. Aren't you, my child? Yes, I'm very much mistaken. No way! Don't let that shit mess with you. You are very much mistaken. And now you are so very No! Tired. It's gonna be something I can press. Come on. I'm very, very tired. No! Fucking stab him! No! Now you're going to do a little oh, bit of work for God me. Damn you. Aren't you? No. No. Uh, What's going on? Where am I? You've been arrested for theft. How very intriguing. I can't remember a jot of it. Let's get you out of here. I've pulled a few strings and they won't prosecute on account of your losing your mind. <laughs> Be free, little chicken. That takes the piss. No. That can't. No. I want to get back at that guy. I really want to get back at him.